guys welcome to today's video today I want to talk a little bit more about skincare and my personal point of view on some products that I have and been in love from the company Tony Molly uh, my name is Felipe call me Phil whichever way you want as long as it's respectful um, I do not tolerate any kind of judgment or any kind of comments that are the meaningful or um, just making feel other people uncomfortable this channel is for you guys to enjoy and have fun so with that being said, I want to welcome you guys. If you are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe or um, comment down below what kind of videos you would like to uh, see and you would like to uh, basically enjoy. Um, so today we're going to be talking about the uh, Vito, Vital Vita 12. I've had the um, red, I think I've had one of each except for the white one. So there is, there are five of this ones um, from this collection. I got this ones, I believe, in Ulta. Uh, they are vitamins basically for your skin. It depends on what will be your concern. This one's retail for uh, $20 each, so it can get a little bit expensive. But now remember, this one has 30 milliliters, so it's not as pricey as a regular serum from other companies. So I would say that this is on the, on the affordable side and it's not as... Um, I personally didn't feel like it was not as effective as other ones that I've tried previously from other brands. I felt like it was just kind of like a little bit diluted with water in a way. Uh, even though I love Tony Molly and I've lived for them for the longest run, um, I actually just recently finished the hand cream that they have, one with the Panda or something like that. Uh, but when it came to this uh, Vital Vita serums or ampules, how they the way they call them, uh, they are made in Korea. Um, this one personally has a vitamin C. It also has vitamin A, B1, B3, B5, B6. B8, B12, vitamin C, vitamin E, and vitamin H. So this one is for the yellow one. Uh, they also have a green one, which I'm gonna probably show you right here, uh, the rest of them. The green one is for calming skin, and it's basically for somebody who has uh, rosacea or redness or has very sensitive skin. That one shouldn't have any ingredients that are gonna be harmful for your skin. The white one, it's uh, recommended for somebody with uh, oilier, skin, oilier skin and has more visibility when it comes to the pores. Uh, the blue one has uh, ingredients that are hydrating and moisture, like hyaluronic acid, which one, which is one of, one of the key ingredients on this one, on the blue uh, Tony Moly Ampule. The pink one is just to brighten up your skin. Now, I use that. I use two bottles of those. I, I'm having a hard time saying this because this is a brand that I really love. But the pink one for brightening, I used it, we used it for like a good six months. We did not, I personally didn't enjoy it. I didn't feel any, I, like I was seeing any results. It actually discouraged me to continue my skincare routine. I wasn't seeing anything. The purple is for firming. The purple one, it's really, really nice. I, I like to massage it on my skin. But again, this is my personal point of view. You may have a different point of view. You may have a different experience than me. My experience with Tony Molly has always been great, has always been enjoyable and pleasurable. In this case, with this Tony Molly Vital Vita serums or ampules, I would just tell them. I wouldn't buy them. I felt like it was a ripoff of my money. I did not see any benefits. Now, a lot of the times we recommend to utilize a product at least a good 30 days. Trust me, I used them more than 30 days and I couldn't see any benefits. It was like mind blowing that a good product and a great brand that I've always followed would really something that it really doesn't. Now, when it comes to packaging, it's, it's kind of cute. It shows you when it's at 30 milliliters. It actually shows you when you're gonna hit the zero. Um, it, it's kind of, um, it's one of those plastic that almost feels like, um, glass so i don't know if it's glass i don't know what it is uh this one expires in 2021 so in two more years i already finished it um i purchased it more than a year ago now 
I don't recommend and God, I don't recommend any of these ampules at all. I had high expectations. I had my beliefs in it. I was strong. I would fight for them with the male because he would say, no, they don't work. They just feel like water. When you put them, it's just so watery. And I agree. I agree. I don't recommend them. They just feel like water. I did not see any results in him or me or even my dad. I put a skincare routine for him. I, I push it every night. I, I just honestly didn't see anything. Sorry, Tony Molly. You, you let me down on this one. Anyways, on the other hand, I do want to recommend you guys, if you haven't seen the movie called um, Abominable, it's kind of like an Asian slash oriental um, uh, movie for kids. I really love it. I felt like it was such a good movie. Um, I can't say any words. I just felt like it was such a good movie. Uh, if you guys have any questions, if you guys have any comments, if you guys want to recommend something that you felt like it worked for you and might work for me, now my skin is usually dry and I can't I tend to have dry patches sometimes if I don't follow a skincare routine. Uh Duamel skin it's more like um combo to oily. Okay, you can get um oiliness in the forehead or just a white head or you know breakouts and my case it's it's not like that. So I'm more into dry. So if you guys want to recommend something, I would greatly appreciate it. Make sure you comment down below, make sure you subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys soon. Thank you guys so much for watching.